Hi again. Today I am going to show you how you can make one page static website using Canva from scratch to publish. Without wasting any time let's get started. Open Canva in any browser or the application. Click on the website button. You can see many templates but we click on the blank page. Once it is opened. Now click on the layout. While it's loading let's add page title. Anything you type here will be go to the navigation bar of the website. This is going to be my home page. Go back to the design section. In the layout section you will find many layouts. Choose home page and click to insert. To add logo in the website click on the elements and search for the frame. Select the frame. Let's delete this first, and adjust the frame to the right place. To add my logo into the frame go to the uploads. Drag the desired logo and drop it above the frame you want to add. Now the logo has been added. Now let's add background image. Click to photos. Then click on background and select the right background for your website homepage. Let me select the perfect one for my site. Let's add title, graphic designer, simply by click and type. You can also add some description and text on button. Let's type learn more. Now change the suitable color of the text. I think the first one looks nice. Perfect. We can also add some effect to the text. By simply click on the effect, and select the effect of your choice. Now add some description. I am putting some sample text here from Lorem Ipsum you can add your own description. Go to new tab, type Lorem Ipsum. Click on the website, and copy some sample text. And paste it in our page. Now adjust it according to the page size. And make its position to backward, by clicking on the position then select backward. Now adjust the button. Now justify the text. And change its color to white to make it visible. Also change the background of the button. So my home page header section is ready. Let's add new section by click again to design. In the layout section choose your desired section. Click on it and add as new page. As I am added sample data. To add profile picture. Go to the photos and search profile. Now drag perfect picture to the frame. You can add yours by go to the uploads. Type your name.
You can also write about yourself under your name. And justify the text. I am changing the background color to white. Add the title of the page. So about me section is ready. Go back to design then layout. And select another layout and add it as new page. Let me drag it a little down so I can add heading. Go to text. And click add a heading. And adjust it on the top of the page. For consistency make the font size same to the previous heading. Now go to photos. And search design. Now select photos of your choice. And drag it to the frame. Let's drag this one. And this one. And this one. And this one. And this one, one more to go. This one looks good. Change its background color. Now three sections of my website has been added. To give it more professional look. Select all the images. And reduce its size. And adjust it in the middle of the page. And adjust the heading too. To add another section again click the design. And add your desired layout as new page. This is my client section. Write names of your clients. And their reviews. And now to insert photos. Again go to photos. Search profile. And drag some photos to the frames. Let me choose the best ones. Perfect. Now to remove the background color right click and select delete. Now add heading. Let me add my clients. Says about me. Format the text as we done previously. Let's add another section by going back to design. In the layout. Click on map. And select the layout. Add it as new page. Now drag the map image to the frame. You can add details. Now change the background. Finally add the footer section. Again from the layout select the footer and add as new page. Change the background color. 
and add your data according to your requirements. We are almost done. To give it a professional look, go to Design and select Style. Choose a page and click Style you want to add. It will change the background color and text color as well as font style accordingly. At the end insert the logo in the footer. Copy the logo from the home page and paste it in the footer. Now let's take a preview. Ooh I forgot to add the titles. Write titles of each page. Because when I publish the website these titles will go to the menu bar. This is gallery page. This is Clients page. Let me adjust this first. So that I can make room for the heading. So this page title will be contact. Now let's begin the magic. At the top bar click on the preview button. My website is ready. Header section is perfect. So is the about section. Let's scroll further gallery looks good too. Clients area is perfect. Contact us and footer looks good too. Ok now up. From select menu select with navigation. You will see the menu bar on the top of the page. As you see it is perfectly linked to each section. One more this is that it is fully responsive. Click on the mobile icon and have a look on how my website looks on mobile. Make sure resize on mobile should be checked. Scroll down and have a look it is pretty cool. As our design is ready let's publish it. Close the preview. And click on publish website. Make sure resize on mobile should be checked. And select with navigation. Click on the free domain. This is going to be my URL. This will be the title of my website. And you add description if you want. Finally click on the publish. My website is going to publish now. Click to view website. Yeah my website is published now. So if you want to make your portfolio, single page static website, or your blog, or even your business information website you can make it by your own. I hope you have learned something in this video. This website URL is in the description. Please let me know your views in the comments. See you in the next video with another exciting topic. See you soon.